hey guys you're welcome back to raisinless kitchen you're very welcome so guys on today's episode i'm going to be sharing with you guys how to prepare your delicious spicy eggusi pepper soup yeah you can have this recipe with your white rice your fufu any fufu of your choice okay so without wasting much of your time i would like to introduce you guys to our ingredients so we get started love you so for this recipe i'll be needing all these ingredients okay i'm going to be listing everything in the description box i have here my crayfish my pepper soup spice onions pepper shrimps blended egusi my meat spinach and seasoning cubes yeah so this is my goat meat so next i'm going to be introducing our salt two seasoning cubes our dried fish, a shredded onions, and of course water. So I'm going to mix everything very well and I'm going to be cooking this for at least 25 to 30 minutes till the meat gets done. After 30 minutes of cooking, I introduced our crayfish. You have to make sure your meat gets done, okay? Sometimes goat meat is so, so hard to cook, so I allow mine to cook for a longer period. Yeah, so I'm going to be adding our blended crayfish. I'm going to stir that very well, and I'm going to be adding our spices. That is our pepper soup spices okay this is going to give you that unique taste we are looking for so when i'm done adding the spice i'll go ahead and add my blended egusi guys before you add your egusi make sure you toast it very well yeah after toasting you blend with water okay so that's it after adding that i'm going to give it a very good stir and i'll be covering our pot to cook this for the next 15 minutes till we see our oil float on top so at this point if you think your soup is a little bit thick please introduce water to loosen it up okay i add a little bit of water just to loosen it up if you cook thick a goosey the way it is going to burn like it's going to burn yeah so to avoid burning add much water because you're going to be cooking it for at least 15 more minutes So after 15 minutes of cooking, as you can see, our oil is floating already, guys. My kitchen smells heavenly, heavenly. <laughs> guys, this this is so delicious. So next, I'm going to be adding my shrimps, okay? You can avoid shrimps if you don't like seafood yeah so i introduced our chili pepper that is our blended chili pepper i give it a very good mix and i'm going to be covering that to cook for another seven minutes after seven minutes of cooking guys just look at that just look at that so 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 delicious it's looking yummy and it tastes heavenly yeah so i introduce our spinach if you have oziza leaf please make use of it yeah it's gonna enhance the taste and the flavor as well so guys we are almost done cooking i don't like overcooking my vegetable for anything so i turned off my cooker and i'm gonna be covering it up now now we are done so i want to say a very big thanks for staying with me throughout this video you can have this with your fufu or white rice whichever one you, you choose to okay so thank you so much for watching until i come your way next time remain blessed i love you Bye.